the smallest, you know, uh, standing ovation uh, all time. Uh, but he will come back to receive the standing ovation he deserved. For Congratulations, Pep. Um, could you just sum up the performances of uh, Kevin De Bruyne and also David Silva today, please? I think we did a, a good job, a good game, especially with and without the ball. And many players were outstanding, uh, Kevin and, and Silva, but uh, Kyle Walker played incredible well, Joao too, and, and Naime and uh, Gabriel. So in general, uh, we were in a in a good in a good uh, mood, and yeah, it's good to finish the, the Premier League season here with uh, uh, in the second position, and, and of course scoring a lot of goals for the prize from Eddie and and, and Kevin. So yeah, it's, uh, now we have two weeks to prepare our game against Madrid. Um, are there many players in the Premier League who could have scored the goal that Kevin did in the first half? Yeah, the, the two. The second one is 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 is, uh, is really nice too, and I like it. I like Kevin for that. You know the assists. We know the quality that he has for this, but we need his goals. We need him. And uh, and today he scored two two brilliant goals. Of course, special the the first one. Thank you. Simon Baskowski. Uh, hi. Nice um, I just wanted to check, uh, you thinking behind the three substitutions at half-time, uh, any injury concerns or is that no. just giving other players no, no. a look in? Yeah, unfortunately I could not give more minutes than other ones, but uh, but no, no. I, I thought before the game, play 45 minutes these players and 45 and other ones. And just a word on Kevin. Did you speak to him before the game about chasing the assist record? No. He knew it. Everyone knows it to the media. And and just we tell them, play simple. Play, you know, as you know, don't be focused too much and and, and achieve it because we'll come alone. And he made he made one assist but could could have break easily the 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 record now we're going to share with T uh, and he, he played really good. Andy Six Smith, please. Hi, Pep. Um, how well equipped do you feel your side, or how good a position do you feel like your side is in to deal with Real Madrid on August the seventh? Now, a uh, different competition, different opponents, so we cannot compare about this. So we have two weeks now. Tomorrow we're going to make a regeneration training, and for the guys who didn't play, going to train one day off, and after we're going to start to to prepare the game, to tell them what we should do, to try to be in the game, to try to do a good game. And, and and that's all. So the target is arrived in the best conditions, mental conditions, to the game against Madrid, and we're going to do it. Just one on Kevin De Bruyne. Apologies if you've already answered this, but he's just said to us in a post match, maybe should have had two more assists this season that have been chalked off. How great is it to see the hunger in De Bruyne? He's a wonderfully talented player, but the hunger there to succeed even more. Now, with the individual targets of focus to achieve something, uh, it's good, you know, the, the athletes always want to overcome and, and be better and always in benefit for the team. And uh, what they do, it is not, not a problem. And, uh, yeah, but today his pace was differently than the last games and the rhythm and everyone was we were more aggressive and, uh, and we did it really well. And just a final one from me on uh, David Silver, of course. I know we've talked about the qualities that David has, has shown in the last 10 years or so, but how popular a member of the team as well as the wonderfully emotional send-off being subbed like that and being embraced by seemingly everyone <laughs> from Manchester City. Yeah, I was the smallest, you know, uh, standing ovation uh, all time. Uh, but he will come back to receive the standing ovation he deserved for for our fans. I know I had the feeling, of course, I didn't speak with my fans, but I had the feeling that they want to do it. And... Um, but I think what the players has done on the pitch and the staff on the players off the pitch uh, show the gratitude, the, the honor that he has to be, uh, has to have for this incredible 10 years that he has done in this club. So just I think the team, the staff want to let him feel that uh, this thank you. Thank you for what he has done for this club uh, 10 years. Thanks, Pat. Really appreciate it. Mike Minet. Hi, Pep. Um, everyone will look at 
Kevin De Bruyne and David Silva, they have done so far. A word on Edison, who has got the Golden Glove today as well. Um, you know, 16 clean sheets, the most of any goalkeeper in the Premier League. A word on him? Yeah, it's so nice. But I think today he deserves it because he makes two incredible saves. Because without him, it would not be possible. So I think it was, uh, uh, was really good. Really, really good. The fact that, uh, that he made a, a really good season. And, uh, and I think these two saves he has done, he deserves uh, what, uh, what he has done. So I don't know externally, but internally, we have an incredible credit what Eddie is as a keeper. Uh, and we are so so happy with, uh, for this award. Uh, and again, just on, on the Real Madrid game, um, you will now start preparing for that. Will Sergio Aguero be part of those plans? Is he going no. to be around? No, I think it will not be possible. With the timing, I think it will not be possible.